Hi, this is Josh Bolivan at Trapper's Landing Lodge. It is June 8th. It's another beautiful day out on Leech Lake. The weather's been gorgeous. The fishing's been phenomenal right now on the lake. Even with calm days and calm conditions like this, you can still go out and find a limit of walleyes out on the lake. So this is some of the best fishing we've had all year. It just started picking up this past week. Uh, maybe or even over the weekend, the Leech Lake Walleye Tournament had some great bags caught in it. Some huge fish were also caught and registered during that tournament. And the fishing's only gotten better this week. So we are seeing water conditions start to go into that 70 degree range. But for the walleye bite, it looks like we're still doing slip bobbers. You still want to be up off the bottom. Other, other ways to catch them right now, bottom bouncers and spinners. Uh, another good way, jigs and minnows are still working for a few guys. We've also heard some crankbaits going on. So trolling, trying to catch those uh, suspended fish right now, all going well. So look anywhere in that 12 to 15 foot range seems to be the most targeted area for most people. Still on those shoreline breaks, but we have started to see some fish transition out into that Pelican Island sub-annex area, some of the mid-lake humps going around the lake. We are also heard some reports here talking to some fishermen yesterday. They were catching fish out to that 18 to 20 foot range. So as always, this time of year tends to be almost our peak bite across the whole lake. We are gonna see that happen or continue on hopefully through this weekend into next week, probably up until the mayflies start hatching. So you're gonna to wanna to look at any of those mid-lake structures, use your side imaging, find those fish. If you have forward facing sonar, that's a great way to find them too. We've been slip bobbering, that's my preferred method right now, slip bobber with a small 32nd ounce or 16th ounce jig underneath the bobber and a leech. So that's where I've been catching most of my fish and they have been two to three feet off the bottom. So when I'm finding them, I'm using my depth bomb, I'm setting my depth and making sure we're two to three feet off the bottom. For everybody still chasing crappies, bluegills, panfish, if you're looking for another fun bite, that is still going on in the shallows around the lake. We've seen a lot of them coming into the fish cleaning shack as well. Reminder, it's five total fish for that one, so uh, per species with that. So just a reminder with that one, uh, while you're out there, you might come up here and think that it used to be the old limits. That is the limit right now on the lake. So fishing will remain good, it looks like. Tell those bugs start going. I've heard some reports a little bit where you can start to see them in the water column. So we're only a couple weeks away from that. It looks like they're gonna be a little bit earlier than last season, which I believe they came out in that 4th of July week. So it's teeing up uh, right now to be some gorgeous weather this weekend. We are hosting the Wounded Warriors Guide Service Take a Vet Fishing. That goes on this Saturday from noon to 4.30, they'll be out fishing. So if you wanna get in with that one, contact Wounded Warriors Guide Service or contact Bobby Landerville out at South Shore Guide Service. They can get you signed up as a vet. If you wanna come up and donate your time and uh, be a help out on the water as a guide, please contact them. They'll get you guys all set up for that one. So we're looking forward to that event. We see a lot of veterans. We've got a walleye meal planned with that one. There is the donation request for that if you guys are, so it is open to the public at that time. Same with from two to five while the guys are out fishing. Uh, we've got live music from Fred Montana going on. So he'll be here on Saturday. We've also got live music on Sunday as well from four to seven. So some awesome stuff going on at the resort. If you're looking at some lodging right now, we still have some great openings here at Trapper's Landing Lodge. Give us a call, 218-836-2500. Get up on this fishing. It doesn't get much better than that right now across the lake. So when you can catch fish in these conditions, it is phenomenal fishing. So from all of us at Trapper's Landing Lodge, we hope to see you out on the water.